The overall goal of this procedure is to assess the species barrier of transmissible spongiform encephalopathies, known as TSEs, to a given species without needing to challenge living animals. This is accomplished by first preparing two conversion assay substrates for use in an in vitro assay. The second step is to incubate these substrates with the TSE agents that you want to test. Next, after digesting with proteinase K, the samples are subjected to SDS page and immunoblotting. The final step is to measure the amount of proteinase K resistant prion protein in each substrate using densitometry and compare these amounts by calculation of a conversion efficiency ratio, or CER. Ultimately, the CER provides a measure of species barrier for the TSE tested to the host species from which the substrate was prepared. Advantages of this assay include its low cost, short experimental time frame, and replacement of living animals with tissue samples. Though this method is well suited to providing insight into the species barriers of wildlife to prion diseases, it can be applied to any other species of interest. Generally, Individuals new to this method will struggle with substrate preparation, quality control, and standardization. After obtaining healthy uninfected brain tissue from the species of interest, prepare a 10% weight per volume homogenate in lysis buffer using downs, bead mill, or mortar and pestle homogenization.